Hey there, are you experiencing crashes or freezes while playing Counter Strike 2 on your computer? No worries, I've got your back. In this video, I'll walk you through the steps to fix these annoying issues once and for all. Let's jump right into it. Solution 1. Verify and repair CS2. First, locate the system tray icon and give it a click. Then, right click on Steam and select Exit Steam. Once that's done, open up the file explorer. Navigate to your C drive. Now, open the program files times 86 folder followed by the Steam folder. From there, head into the user data folder and then into the folder within the numbers. Now, delete the 730 folder and close it. Afterward, launch Steam. Go to your library. Right click on Counter Strike 2 from the left side menu and select properties. Click on installed files. Hit the verify integrity of game files button. Steam will start verifying and repairing the game. Now check if the issue is fixed after afterward. Solution 2. Use launch options. Open up Steam, then head to your library. Next, right click on Counter Strike 2 from the left side game list and select properties. Now in the launch options, type in hyphen Vulcan and then close the window. Check if the game opens up. If not, try typing hyphen autoconfig in the launch options. Solution 3. Turn on compatibility mode for Counter Strike 2. Open up Steam, then go to your library. Next, right click on Counter Strike 2. Now hover over Manage and then select Browse Local Files. Open the Game folder and then the Bean folder. Next, go to the Win64 folder, find the CS2 executable, right click on it and select Properties. Then switch to the Compatibility tab. Check the box that says Run this program in Compatibility Mode 4. After that, choose Windows 8 from the drop down menu. Click on Apply and then OK to save these settings. Now the game shouldn't crash or freeze up when playing. And there you have it. You've successfully fixed the CS2 crashing or freezing issue on your computer. If this video helped you out, don't forget to hit that like button. Have any questions? Feel free to drop them in the comments below and I'll get back to you real soon. Thanks a bunch for watching.